the issues are this. Um, the first issue is demography. World population increasing by about 7 million a month, greater than the population of the uh, UK um, in a year, um, and that's continuing. The second major driver apart from population is urbanisation. People are moving from the countryside into the urban environment and predictions going forward are quite substantial. Something of the order of 60 to 70 percent of people will be living in cities um, by 2030. The third one, which is actually really rather important, is the fact that um, to a good extent um, the world is getting a little bit richer. Pe poor people are still there, there is still the bottom billion people, um, the phrase coined by the Oxford economist Paul Collier, but people are getting rather wealthier, and one of the, particularly in South Asia. So these are very large drivers of what is actually happening in the world. I posed the question in the perfect storm saying by 2030 um, these three drivers will mean that we need to have something of the order of 40 to 50 percent more food, um, 40 to 50 percent more available energy, and by that you mean low carbon energy, and 30 to 40 percent of available fresh water. Now taken together in just two decades that's an enormous demand on the world system and at the same time we're going to have to think about ways that we mitigate and adapt to climate change and that is why I've called it a perfect storm by, because within just two decades these th three external drivers will mean we have to find more food, more water, more energy and at the same time mitigate and adapt to climate change.